ground here pretty sharp when we were back to 3550 and we had an order in to uh, sell at that level. We've sold a few of the uh, 10 lots that we were uh, trying to sell here at uh, 3550. So uh, the suits can fill in the rest. We just kicked that 3550 in the can. What we see here is we see a lot of um, really a technical bounce here. 3500 was an area that we were looking for the initial open of the year to push down. We got to 35. Uh, 05 and change yesterday. Uh, hung around there most of the morning and now have uh, begun the retracing. So the next uh, little bit here will be key. Um, and uh, just want to point out that uh, we do believe in the street area to leg into a short. Very close to 170 area to us looks like the area you want to be short. You're obviously wrong if we make new highs. So uh, again, the bigger piece of the area that I would sell would be up here towards 8085, but this whole 50 to 65 area is a good area to start, and then I would leg in a final piece of the position up into here, just shy of 3600, and see if uh, we can hold there. Okay, we have filled on our uh, order here again at 3550. You can see we finally filled here at 722 on the West Coast. Again, this is uh, we're willing to build into a trade really here. Order pending. Order pending. Two points off at 48 there uh, as we stepped away during the uh, lunch hour to 
here and uh, we're heading for a stoppage that we call it at 35.48. We're now at 48.75 and I'm still short half the position and we're still bidding down here at 35.38. We'll be back later in the day to see if the trade moves our way or if we are able to sell a bit back on up here higher. Otherwise, we're just going to sit still with the position and bid a little bit lower for the day. 35.50, we sold um, 10 and covered 5 at uh, 35.48. It for now, and uh, we'll be back in a bit. Uh, 10 18 on 12 12. All right, we are uh, continuing to grind up here <coughs> in the uh, afternoon lunch slop here, as we call it here on uh, Tuesday. We're going to sell uh, Order pending. five more again. We'll Order sure pending. We took uh, half off at 48. We're going to offer five more out at 35.58. We like this area again just to sell into, coming back into. Uh, the resistance uh, after mopping up uh, this area in here we're spending some time in this area 40 uh, you know basically 43 to 50 today most of the value area so that's good and uh, we're, we're, we're widening this a little bit we'll see what happens when we get back into the the fat part of the profile again time tells us here that this is going to be it's going to take this market a little bit of time to get above say 58 to 68 so our next area uh, uh, that we're interested in here is 58 and then we'd probably sell a little bit more at 68 and then uh, again one more probably at 78 uh, 5 5 and 5 probably something like that size wise for us today uh, again the volume is very slow we're gonna see what we can get done there and uh, we're trading 33.52 and we've got an offer in again at 58 next alright we have uh, rolled back over again here we're gonna move uh, Order pending. Actually, you might even make it um, 50 cents here, 47, excuse me. And uh, <coughs> we're going to let the rest go. Looking for 38, so one hint to the other here, OCO, 47.38. We'll see how this trade finishes up here to us through lunch. It is 11.09 p.m. on Tuesday, June 27th. All right, we have moved our stops in the second half of the NASDAQ down here to 46. Stops at 36, and uh, market is slowly selling off again here, doing what we had thought it would, and I still think it'll pull back to this uh, breakout area, probably the 30, 35, 36 area, and then probably just got to bid slightly above there at 38. So, again, a couple hours ago in the day's market, it's got to stop in at 46. We'll see how the trade plays out. All right, just one more update here, just a few moments later. Again, most of this trade today has been very tight in this uh, range, really here, uh, 42 to 50, I'd say. So 8.8 for the bulk of the day after that opening half hour has not been very wide, especially in the NASDAQ. So we're bidding. We've got an OCO, 38.45. We're getting oversold on the RSI. Uh, but, again, this is the area that we thought we'd test at least. We got to a 61.8 for the day. Uh, there at 47.5, banging off that a little bit, and I've got a bid just below. So we're going to give it a little bit more room, trying to take the meat of what the day has given us here today, which again is not very wide. So we're already pretty proud of uh, what we got. We've got five points locked up on the second half after after taking a couple points earlier, and uh, that's a pretty simple trade. Uh, again, that we were looking for this move to 35.50. We got up to 53, got in the trade, and uh, we'll be back to see where it closes out later in the day. All right, it looks like we're going to get uh, taken out of the uh, second half here, 11.29. We're trading 35.44. Again, we mo had moved our stop to 35.45, getting oversold, bouncing. Again, we bounced off that 60-bib number there. I still think we'll probably trade to this 38, so uh, you know, part of me wants to stick with the trade, but uh, trade a little bit longer, but I'm going to leave the stop, uh, and maybe we can sell it again back out at 35.50. So if we get stopped here at 45, I'll probably uh, put another uh, order in to sell uh, on a bounce order. here again into the end of the day. So order so pending. And again, if I get stopped at 45, I'll, uh, I'll resell again at 50 and 58 and, and get back in the trade. But I uh, just wanted to give a quick update, and we'll be back here uh, as the trade closes out again, either at 38 or 45. Very tight range uh, all day here, Tuesday, January 7th.
And again, just as we paused, we got stopped out there at uh, 4545. And again, we'll kill the uh, order below. And uh, we'll offer 50 50 order canceled day here at 1130. If we uh, get back in, we will put those uh, back uh, back out and uh, we'll be back uh, to discuss another trade later. Thanks for watching. Peace.